Fashion. I literally feel so good when I'm wearing clothes that I love and I just feel so confident in like my day can actually be influenced so much by how much I like my outfit which sounds so weird but I know that you guys feel it too like I know and if you're watching this video you probably are as obsessed with fashion and clothes and building outfits as I am or hopefully like close. Today I'm going to be showing you guys some of my favorite outfits that I've been loving recently. Cute little trends that I've been really into and also I'm going to be continuing to build my 2020 summer wardrobe and I'm going to go online shopping with you guys. Let's get on into my favorite outfits that I've been loving wearing recently. I am so sorry about these angles but this is the only place in my house that I can film right now. Guys, my room is getting ready, but okay. This is the first outfit and I freaking love it. I am obsessed with one, printed skirts, and two, leopard print, cheetah print, animal print. I feel like I missed out on the beginning of the trend, but now that the trend's finally here and probably on its way out, to be honest, I am now interested suddenly. And this is actually pretty comfortable. Like it doesn't ride up that much, except when you like sit down and then get back up. But honestly, you can just pair basically any basic like black top with cheetah or just like a nice printed skirt. And I decided to accessorize it. So I have the Stella and Luna Le Papillon Choker and Stella and Luna Butterfly Earrings. These, I actually, you can go like two ways with this. You can go super girly or you can make it more grunge. So I decided just to make it more grunge for a change. Although these shoes literally have given me permanent blisters forever. So like a permanent chunk of my skin is now gone. They're just Doc Martens. They're like the regular ones, not the platforms. Skirts, basic tops, I've been loving recently. Okay, this is outfit number two. I am obsessed with this outfit and there's just a lot of cute things about it. So first of all, this dress is from Shein. Yeah, it is a bodycon dress, but it's also kind of loose. Like it's not super tight at the bottom. It has a nice little slit, which adds something to it, but it's also like not too short. So I feel like this isn't too scandalous of a thing. I have a curly little ponytail on and I decided to put a little scarf in it. This scarf is from... Um, urban planet you can also tie scarves on your purse or you can even tie them on your wrist you can freaking wear them as shirts now so and I also have on the bottom my platform supergas and high white socks that is another thing that I've been loving and I have been loving for like a couple of years now these ones I literally just got from like I don't know like Walmart or Superstore or something what I really want to get is those ones that have a cute little like Nike swish on them this outfit was actually created by me working out in the morning and then not wanting to change at all <laughs> during that day. So I basically just turned this into a very athletic themed outfit, but it's just the most comfortable thing ever. Airy leggings, these are one of my favorite leggings I've ever worked out in because they are just so power holding. They actually cut off at the right length, but I usually like to wear my Lululemons or my Fabletics ones, but just nice option here. Super high waisted and I'm going to be wearing a crop top with it. I don't think this is like a workout shirt. This is just from Aritzia, but I got it on such a good price. Like it was such a good sale and then I have my Nike airs on so I have this hat because um, my hair was really dirty on that day so I decided to wear a hat and then I was like wow I actually really like this outfit I have these rose gold hoops that I'm gonna add just to make it a little bit more like casual street style instead of I just came from LA fitness cute really nice athletic outfit easy Pinterest worthy visco worthy done next outfit okay hear me out hear me out um this is just the concept of this outfit, not necessarily the outcome of this outfit that I like. So basically what I'm trying to get at is biker shorts with a long t-shirt dress or just like a huge like graphic tee. I don't know, the idea of this outfit I really like, so don't even focus on the shirt, just pretend that's not there. These biker shorts are actually the softest ones I've ever worn. They're from Aerie. When I see that they're high-waisted, like it's like up here, like that's where the waist is. So and you can also like pull them even higher. They're just so high-waisted and you can also adjust them to be like super long. I have my platform Supergas on with this just to keep it casual. And then I put bigger gold hoops in my ears just to kind of like elevate the outfit. Okay, this is the final outfit that I'm going to be showing. Um, it's also just like the idea of this one as well. I really love when I have basic tops on the top that are black or like kind of just like interesting in some way. I love this cutout at the front. This is from Shein. I'm not going to be buying from that anymore. And then I have some bucket shorts on the bottom, the tight on the top and puffy on the bottom design, design style. I don't know what I'm saying anymore. I have my hoops in as well to elevate the outfit and then I have these bad boys. It's kind of a simple outfit on the top. On the bottom, you can just hit him with a nice chunky dad sneaker. 
Let's go shopping for some more cool, trendier items that are hopefully going to be better than the outfits that I just showed you. I'm kind of thinking of shopping from Zaffle because if I'm gonna buy super trendy pieces, I don't wanna be spending like literally $80 on them. So I'm gonna go to Zaffle. That, that's not how you spell it. Canada. That's not how you spell Canada either. <laughs> Basically, I'm just gonna try to find everything that I can on here so that I don't have to order from a million different stores. The first thing that I'm going to look for are kind of sets like this, like a skirt and a top set. Um, that's actually Sarah, hi Sarah. And sets like this, like the plaid, the blue plaid, that set is so good. Also, I have been obsessed with these tennis skirts, if you know what I mean. I'm basically gonna go here and see if they have anything here. Oh. Okay, $19, like these are the prices that I need. Okay, so let me just sign in so I can literally favorite everything. R E B P F N. On that's an age, isn't it? Honestly, I literally never get those right. <laughs> it's kind of embarrassing because I have such bad eyesight. I love this like Burberry pattern. Let's not eliminate anything because sometimes I'm too picky and then I go back and I'm like, oh, I have nothing in my cart. It's kind of basic. Is that the skirt that Sarah was literally wearing? It is. <laughs> oh my God. It actually is the exact same skirt that like flower one. I wonder how short that top is. You know, I'm gonna try it. That one's not bad either. I like the black and the daisy. Is that a daffodil? Is that a, I don't know. Keep looking, I don't see anything that I like. That's kind of cute. Even though it is a little bit basic, but. Oh, the yellow one, I know. Oh, this one's so cute. Okay, that's like a must and it's 16. This one, I don't know why, but I've always been so into like those black and white, either checkered pattern or like the little squares. Might have to invest in that. Next page. I think we already have too money. It's like we're already over budget. No. No. I see I'm not, I'm also not just trying to look for casual pieces because I have so many casual ones. I don't have enough fancy ones. Oh, that one could be really cute. I literally did pin like a polo shirt like that because I love when there's a little collar there. No. Oh, add that one. Now I'm just gonna look at some skirts. Maybe, whoa, maybe they'll have a little bit of a cuter skirt selection than like the matching tops and it might be a little bit cheaper. They have a pleated plaid mini skirt. That could be so cute. Light blue. Okay. I don't really like the flowy ones. That's a yes. I love those bright colors. That's another checked pleated mini skirt. Mm -hmm. I feel like Shein and Zaffle kind of have some of the same things because I feel like I've been on Shein and I'm like, wow, I literally just saw that on Zaffle. So I feel like they have the same products or like kind of similar ones. Oh, I just don't know if it's going to be see-through or not. That's why I hate buying online like white stuff because you don't know if it's going to literally like see your butt. Oh, that's nice. I enjoy that. It's so hard when there's like people watching me shop because usually I'm just like, like so focused on what I'm doing, but now I have to like actually explain what I'm doing. Okay, so let's go back to my little inspiration board. Oh, okay, so I'm looking for cute dresses such as that one or this one, just kind of like florals or cute little patterns. I've been so into wearing like more feminine, girly clothes in the moment. So I'm gonna look for just cute mini dresses. Like that's just so cute with some high socks and like platform supergas or dad sneakers or just like regular tennis shoes. See, is that literally the... No, it's not. Okay, but it's really similar. I'd probably try and get it in the blue. I'm trying to really branch out from my freaking black and white filled closet. I don't have any color in my closet. I really like the plaid, so I'm gonna try that. Oh, there's a cute little... I love the bright colors too. Like, it's not like I don't like color. I just, my eye doesn't go to it. Have a black dress. Say, do you do not buy black? Do not buy black. See, like, why am I obsessed with this checkered thing? Again, like, I don't know why. I just want it. Okay, let's try it. I'm not feeling it, not feeling it. Oh, I like that. Oh, there's a... <laughs> the leopard skin one. Let's just get that completely see-through one. Just wear nothing underneath. Oh... Hi. Please say that you have more colors because I will buy you. I'm gonna treat this as a birthday present to myself. That's true, my birthday's in like two days. Actually, no, I'm posting this on my birthday. So happy birthday to me. Um, you're just like a bunch of clothes that you didn't need. Okay, I literally have 51 hearts. Oh, so the other thing that I kind of wanted are just more graphic t-shirts because I actually got rid of a lot of mine when I moved and now I kind of just want those like grungy graphic tees that I can crop like the Harley Davidson one. I was kind of thinking I could thrift those. Like, I don't think I really need to buy those online, especially. Oh, I also wanted to look for shirts like this. Oh, what did I do? With a cute little like bandana thingy that's so trendy. So I don't even know how to search that up. Do I just say bandana shirt or like scarf shirt? Oh, okay, okay. 
Oh, okay. The colors, and these are so nice. It also wouldn't hurt if we got one swimsuit. Would it hurt? Like, would it hurt anyone? Oh my god, that's Emma! Oh, goodness me. Okay, I'm literally gonna get all of her swimsuits, so bye. I will actually come back to you guys when I have my full cart of stuff that I'm going to buy, and then I will place the order. I have finalized my cart. First, I have, let me just zoom in here, this Zaffel tie-dye knotted bikini that is from Emma McDonald's collection. I'm so excited to try them out, and they're so affordable. So this is $14, and then this other one is another surprise tie-dye one, which is pink, and it's $9.99. Then I have the ribbed, like, collared pink crop top. Then I have the bandana top. These shorts that are actually sick and they're like a really deep blue color. If you can hear people talking, it's my parents. This really nice businessy plaid bodycon dress. I have this really cute floral blue dress, plaid mini skirt, which I'm really hoping is going to fit. I will keep you updated on my Instagram if it does. The pleated mini skirt, then the black and white set, and this red set. So I'm so excited. My total is $146 for 11 pieces, $146, and I'm going to use Honey to get some money off of that. This is not even sponsored, but I literally always use Honey on Zaffle. Yeah, I'm going to place this order and that's gonna be it for this video so thank you guys so much for watching i hope that you are not concerned for my shopping addiction for my fashion addiction like i hope you were on the same page and i will probably post a little haul on tiktok or maybe on my story like a try on haul and i hope you have an amazing day i love you so much and i will see you in my next video bye